this morning. Many people across the country, unfortunately, are clearing up, cleaning up, too, from destructive storms. They relied on the up-to-the-minute forecast to prepare for the worst. These images were captured by a new weather satellite designed to make those forecasts a little more accurate. The photos from the potentially life-saving technology were released yesterday. Jan Crawford is at the NOAA facility in Suitland, Maryland, with what makes this satellite so special. Jan, good morning. Well, Gail, so this new satellite, the GOES-16 is what they call it. It sits 22,000 miles above the Earth, and it sends its data here to those satellite dishes over there. And meteorologists say that is going to help them better predict where and when bad weather will hit. I think that's a tornado. This week saw deadly tornadoes, violent waves, and torrential rain. You can't prevent bad weather, but meteorologists will soon have a new tool to better predict it using a satellite called GOES-16. GOES is better, faster, higher resolution, more information, and new information that we haven't had before. And liftoff. Launched two months ago, it unveiled its first images on Monday. Fires burning in Mexico, clouds over Florida and the Northeast. When it becomes fully operational by November, GOES-16 will provide images at four times the resolution of current satellites. It will also be able to take pictures of an individual storm every 30 seconds. Currently, radar systems can only scan a storm every five to six minutes. This greater resolution with a higher speed will allow us to actually see in real time storms and events as they're occurring. It can help measure storm intensity by tracking lightning strikes. The experts say GOES-16 would have been a great help in a deadly weather week like this one. There's no doubt in my mind that it would have made, it, made a difference in the way we were uh, following these systems. With 30-second imagery, we'd be able to see those changes with a clarity that we've never seen before. This means accuracy for the viewers, and that's huge. So as Evelyn like, Taft like is a meteorologist here, at CBS in Los Angeles. Right there, you just see so much more with that picture that you get. You can warn people earlier. So if we've got thunderstorms here at home, we can tell you where's that cell, where that lightning is, everything. Now, experts say that this new satellite will give them a, a better and sharper picture of weather patterns. So that means instead of just getting a five-day forecast, you might get them much further out, which I think is pretty cool because, you know, that'll make those, you know, beach vacations just a little easier to plan when you want better weather. Gail? Jan, I know you can't wait to get into a bikini. <laughs> I, I like anything that gives you a five <laughs> no, to seven no, no day bikinis. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Tankini, that's nice too. <laughs> Jan, always good to see you. Always good to see you. Thanks, Gail.